Hey guys, I got this unique board right now. It's called a Mayer Hopper, and it's uh, a lot of people refer to it as the peanut. It's a really interesting board. I'm gonna go take it out, ride it, and see what I, see what I think of it. it. It's designed by a designer uh, from, I believe, San Francisco, and uh, engineered to be hydrodynamic, and uh, crazy things going on about it. In theory, the back, this part of the board is supposed to be like a short board, fast, responsive. Uh, the front half or part is uh, supposed to be, you know, like a long board so you can get up on the nose and ride it. I did ride it uh, a couple waves uh, a couple days ago, and so far so good. I had difficulty finding the sweet spot at first, but it floats. And I'll show you the back. The back, it's got a lot of V. It starts right about here, and it's just got a ton of V all the way to the tail. And uh, the nose seems to be kind of concaved out a little bit. Um, but the fins are placed what looks like so far forward from the tail that I'm not really sure where I'm supposed to stand, but I'm going to try. And I can imagine it turns really sharp and uh, fast. The rails are sharp all the way through out here. And they kind of kind of get just a little more rounded here. It's still turn, turned down a little bit, but uh, I'm going to go give it a test run. This one's a 9.6, and uh, I imagine the paddle's pretty good, so I'm going to give it a shot. I'll see you guys when I get out of the water. All right, I just got out of the water with this uh, 9.6 Meyerhofer, or Meyerhofer, however you want to say it. It kind of rides like a shortboard. It's, if you get your foot back, the thing pivots really fast. I did a couple uh, off the lips, kind of straight up and straight down. That surprised me. I didn't think I could do it. But there's a lot of swing weight to it. But um, the cool thing is if you get behind on the wave, you can run up to the nose and catch up again. You can um, find new things every time you take it out and ride it. Uh, so it's a really fun board. I may consider getting one of these for my quiver, uh, just because it's a new concept, new design. Uh, overall, I think I liked it. I like to spend more time on it. Um, but for my first uh, few waves, I like it so far. And uh, you know, I'm not a, a tech guru or design guru. I'm not a shaper, but uh, I was able to ride it. And I usually catch waves pretty easy on it. It paddles really wild because it's real thin in the middle, so your stroke is closer to your body and straight down. I'm not really sure what the dynamics of that is, but I like it. I think you should go out to your shop. I got this one from Surfride, and uh, they were cool enough to let me take it out. So go to Surfride, check them out. They've got a ton of boards you can ride, and they'll uh, you can uh, demo these for really cheap or other boards that they have. So I give it a shock, a thumbs up. Fun, fun board. Take it, At least go take it out and try it. So fun board.